Hey, I am Kimbo and I blog at agrimalgugan.com and I'm going to do a fun project that we got out of the September mystery box for Expressions Vinyl. We're going to be using the wood blank, the ghost that came with it, and then we're going to be using the gray adhesive um, vinyl. You also need, well, paint. I'm going to paint mine white. I guess you could leave it like this if you wanted to. And then since I'm going to be using mine as a charbuterie board, I am going to put this dishwasher safe Mod Podge over it. There's a couple different options if you want to make it food safe. Um, but I'm just putting like marshmallows and white chocolate covered pretzels on it. So I'm not too concerned about it. Nothing's going to be seeping in. Um, but that's what I'm going to use. White paint. Dishwasher save my punch. I already cut out my vinyl. It says charbuterie. This is one of the cut files that came with the mystery box. I'm going to make it double sided and so I haven't cut out the other vinyl for the back. I think I'm going to use the bippity boppity boo for the opposite side. Okay, why I'm waiting for paint to dry, I wanted to show you my shirt that I made. This is one of the cut files that was in the mystery box as well, and I used the orange puff vinyl. I don't know if you guys have tried the puff vinyl. It cuts, it's like super smooth, it cuts smooth, and then when you put the heat on it, it puffs up. It's so addicting. Go get one in like every color. Okay, I already put the Mod Podge on one side. I'm trying to figure out which side it was. Um, when I say this is dishwasher safe Mod Podge, that doesn't necessarily mean that I would run it through the dishwasher. It still would. I just was trying to make it a little bit more food safe. That way if anything accidentally spills on it, it's just a little bit easier to clean up. So don't put it in the dishwasher. <laughs> Okay, so I wanted to do, we've got the charbuterie on that side, and I wanted to do a cute one just so I could put it up, um, you know, all of October, not just when I'm using it for my charbuterie. So I cut this out. Look at how good those cuts are. It says bippity boppity boo. And then I just hand cut the eyeballs and stuck them in there. And then I'm just going to weed away. the vinyl and then I will add my transfer tape and put it on. All right, make sure that you are subscribed to A Girl in a Glue Gun and Expressions Vinyl so you can see all the fun projects we made with the mystery box.